near Sharon crossing the river Styx, executed somewhere between 1520 and 1524, the year of his death. Patnir is a mysterious, almost forgotten artist to whom not much attention had been paid until a 2007 Prado. The artist has divided the space vertically into three zones, one on either side and the third occupied by the broad river in the center on whose opaque and mirror-like surface Karen steers his boat. For the iconography of this subject, Patner draws together biblical images and classical sources. And so this is presumably this broad river is the River Styx. And we'll show you some details in a moment, but on one side you can see an angel in the beautiful landscape. On the other side, uh, you will see devils and in the background, this fiery hell. So this is obviously heaven and hell in the Christian sense. Uh, and uh, Karin now is uh, ferrying that soul. The basic elements of his landscape style, the high viewpoint overlooking fast tracts, where earthy brown foregrounds merge into woodland and meadow greens and again into the hazy blues of distant mountains, do not differ from those of his predecessors, particularly Gerard David. Yet the picturesque melancholy with which he invests the woods and rivers and the great ghostly rocks that jut up abruptly in the middle distance of the painting strike a personal note that one Peytonier instant success and many imitators. <laughs> 